when you are honest sometimes, it requires accepting a lot of discomfort into your life. How do you deal with that? I've had those moments. How does Bino, and I know you've got some terrific artists, but I know they also are, are very you much the artists. Yeah, I mean, ultimately, you have to be willing to put your nuts on the line. I, I live that way with my artist. I'm not a, uh, I'm not a guy who, who wants to tell my artist something to, to pacify them, but rather earn their respect and their trust through time and have the tough conversations, and they are with me. I think we've built relationships built on trust. But uh, I'm willing to take it on the chin as long as they hear me. And at the end of the day, if they're hearing me and I'm hearing them, then they can make the right decision based on the knowledge that they have that I presented them. Yeah. Do you feel like so? Now, you've been with System of a Down now for, what, 15, 16 years? Yeah, yeah. Do you ever feel like you got married to five people? Absolutely. <laughs> and you know what? Listen, that, I think that System's music and what they do and what you hear on stage and what you hear on record is, is, a, is an indication of their personality, which is they come together in this wild, crazy, amazing, you know, ethnic, ethereal, powerful, frantic, everything comes out. That's their personality. There's four really different guys. Mm -hmm. And I have a relationship with each one of them. Um, and it is time consuming and it is managing different entities. You have to weigh out what it's worth. Yeah. And to me, that's, an, that, that's a very rare, a rare outfit that, that I've come up with. And we have a strong love affair. And, and I'm willing to, t willing to endure that long term. Do you find that most of the, 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 the difficult moments you have with a band um, happen right at that intersection of you wanting to do the right thing as a business person, which typically is a very kind of rational type of uh -huh. mentality that managers have. They have to be accepting. Versus the artists that are coming much from a, more from a feel, Right. sensitivity point of view. For depends, me, that's where we battle. It depends on the band. I mean, you know, I have, you know, again, I think that when, when I talk to Be Real and Send from Cypress Hill mm -hmm. versus Jerry and Sean and, and Mike and William from Alice or the guys in the system or AFI who I'm just learning now, I think different artists have different propensities and different aspects of what they do well and what they need help on. I mean, um, you know, that does come up, no doubt about it, you know? I mean, let's face it, when you're on tour, that usually the tour tee with the photo tee with the dates on back is the biggest seller. The bands don't like that as much, but that, at the end of the day, is big. so have that be one of the eight, eight shirts. You yeah. know? So, I mean, it comes up, but um, my challenges have been equally as, as, as trying to internally keep everyone on the same page.